Welcome citizens of YouTube, I am Phoenix Ozges and today I am playing the original war Original war, how am I doing of war? Alright, I'm a bit scatbrained at the moment, so... Ah. Don't forgive me. Please forgive me uh, for that. So today, we are going to be playing... Uh, again, Dawn of War, and... I'm gonna settle on... This silent but creepy fella. The Necrons. Dawn of War, Dark Crusade. The Necrons had lain buried in the sands of Cronus for eons, having retreated there at the end of a great war only hinted at in the histories of ancient races like the Eldar. Long before man even stood upright, the Necrons and their dark gods had retreated to their tomb world. But their slumber was not eternal. Eventually, their genocidal deities awoke them again, driving them to purge the life that had spread across the galaxy during this deep. On Cronus, this awakening came when an archaeological team opened a mysterious crypt on the arid Thor Abyss Plateau. Most of the team died. But expedition leader Thomas Maccabee somehow became one of the mysterious Necron pariahs. Seemingly retaining a hint of his personality, he occasionally spoke for the silent army as it advanced. The Necron Lord of Cronus, the most ancient and powerful of the deathless creatures on the planet, promptly launched a campaign of extermination. Sorry, His loathsome god, the Nightbringer, hungered for the deaths of all those on Cronus. I don't give I don't give him a name. It's a name. Seriously. Harness Tomb World. Let's see. I'm gonna have to move up over there in order to come down to here. Chances are that. Hmm. What? That's right, he's going to move down to here, and you're going to move over to there, or to there. It'll be your first order. So meanwhile, you'll have a choice of moving up. So, I might as well Welcome to the single-player campaign for yep. Dawn of War, Dark Crusade. Don't need it, though. Well, where? How this works. Not the mm. model or a score. Taking so to here. Do time going from there. Go after it. Yeah, I wanted not to get popular struck. Immediately go after that, which I should have done in the early phase of setting up. A little recording. I 
do love the music. Let me turn that. And that gives me... Ah, so that doesn't eat into anything. But... Good. Down here, that, that's where you're gonna come up from this far left line. That's the main attack route that the AI usually takes. So we're gonna go from the right direction. I have you stand there. You get construction that makes no energy, brilliant. Good, you're doing your part. At the moment, that cannot attack anything, not until I upgrade it. Scarabs. Which... Blitz of the battlefield around my monolith. Eventually, I can resurrect them, and... The brilliant part about that is, if they get destroyed anywhere on the field, they're almost like a landmine. So once I... Once, once I start rebuilding them, they will resurrect where they original, where they fell. You can in assist there. Of course, the ants are a bit chunky for the Necrons. I'm gonna have you. I'm gonna have to plan for. plan ahead, making routes. Uh, generate a core. build six of these in total. Try and increase ones. Build a view while at the same time increasing my build speed. Enough. 
that's gonna be all right that's good you finish construction there and you go over here take that no 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 I lost that grenade launcher. What were you thinking? Obviously not much. Scarabs can do it. Right, that's great. That's not more. Oh, not three. Two more. Done. Energies pulse across the living metal of the Necron Warriors. Those Necron Warrior health and damage. Yeah. And we'll resurrect that a little bit. Ah, I'll take that. Hey, too far ahead, mate. Too far ahead. Fifty. 
fifty. Here we go. And the metal on my way out of it. To the front. Things don't get any nice for our bill. Bill? Oh god. He's wearing Bill's skin. Why? Yeah, they tend the computer tends to be spawned up around this area here. So just to make certain we don't get anyone that slips through. The other one on the fence there. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh god. Oh god, no. Well, scarabs, that's brilliant. Send you down. Take care of that mess. Cover you. Send you down there. You are. Have another spear. Yes. Um. How dare you? How freaking dare you? What? I'm about to lose your stuff, man. Here's what's gonna happen. You're gonna lose all your all your kit. Fine with your food.
I would appreciate this, sis. Well, if they did not have their emotions removed and could fully express themselves, I'm certain they would appreciate this, sis. I cannot get the grade ones out until I get the rest. The previous upgrades, that is. Let's see. Most definitely going to take that first. Now I have this province. The requisition that I have, I can use it to reinforce my position, but to greatly increase the defensive capabilities of each province. Uh, if I have acquired on a guard units, I can even use that to purchase. Um, units to accompany me on any, you know, accompany my commander in the opening stages of any offensive unit, uh, movement. Turn that, it'll take a couple of turns. No. I really don't want to leave chance that when I don't have the commander anywhere near there, I might be attacked, so I'm going to reinforce the base first. So it's going to be 60. Well, is it going to be 160 plus 360? That hasn't been affected much. So let's end the turn. So let's see what. For chaos. Yep. Fall back and regroup. Judge! 
We must with Ah, yep, yeah, sorry. Back, I want to defend his stronghold, and I will myself hold off until next week. So, let's save it as Necron. Or oh, how about spooky, scary. Oh, okay, fine. Space skeletons. Okay. Space skelly. There we go. Space skeleton. Space skelly. Says everything. 